Okay, we ventured from Moe's over to Bonfire Brewing, um, just about a block away. Brian Kunkel's joining us first thing this morning. You're walking down the street, you're like, let's get this done. So we're out on the, this is kind of the patio area where the bonfire is. Brian, thanks for coming in today. Oh, I'm so happy to be here. Yeah, this is kind of our gathering area outside. We do a lot of live music out here on the patio. Uh, people like to gather around our fire right here. This is our, our, our outside bonfire. Um, but, you know, during the day, it's a great place to come get sun. At night, it's a great place to kind of get warm. Um, you know, it's, yeah. a, it's a place to hang out. So, Brian, uh, if we have new viewers watching for the first time, let's give them the story of Bonfire, like where it started and, and what, you're, what it's all about. Absolutely. Well, it started back with uh, my two uh, original owner, um, Andy Jensen and Matt. Uh, Andy and Matt were friends. They, uh, Matt lived in Andy's basement, more or less, um, and they just started making beer for fun. Um, and after a while, uh, they were able to start selling their beer in small amounts to different restaurants around town. And Andy at the time was a lawyer at the county and decided that um, he didn't enjoy his job anymore and rather make beer and uh, <laughs> so they opened up the bonfire and at, at the time it was a very limited menu I think there was five beers on tap and now we have 23 so it's just been like a nice steady cl climb to the very Brian, are the, the beers you have some beers that are made right on premises then you have another location where more is made is that correct we do it's uh, so this is kind of like our research and development lab more or less we have a couple seven barrel systems here but uh, the majority of our brewing takes place up on Chambers Avenue where we have our big brewery uh, we have our 50 barrel system there it's where we do like the bon uh, our, our IPA our um, our Kindler pale ale um, and the rest of kind of our, our regular SKUs and is that facility can people come up there? Is there a tasting room there? Does everything happen here if people want to come and have the beer? Uh, people are more than welcome to come up to the facility and say hi to the brewers. We don't really have a tasting room there. Um, we definitely do shotgun a lot of beers off the canning line from time to time, especially in the morning. There's nothing like a good shotgun beer in the morning. Um, but uh, you, uh, people are more than welcome to always make a reservation, come up, check out that brewery if they want. Uh, but this is really more of where we kind of serve everyone. Okay, so show downtown, the big event that happens every Thursday down in Eagle, wrapping up for the summertime. You're one of the big sponsors of that. What's kind of coming up for the fall? Do we have some, obviously, live music, some activities here at Bonfire? Any beer that we should be made aware of that's in the test stages or no? Well, we have the uh, Habacremo coming up on deck. Uh, it's a kind of a Habacremo, uh, Habacremo cream ale. Um, it is delicious, smooth, nice little spice in your mouth. Uh, we do have some great events coming up. Uh, the show downtown is over, but we're still doing live music on Thursday nights out here on the patio all the way through September. In fact, Robbie Peoples is, is going to be our house musician uh, starting in September on Thursday nights. And Robbie puts out a good show, too. He's entertaining. Robbie's a lot of fun. You can't, if, you, if you've never heard Robbie before, you should definitely come out for one of his performances. He's, he's, a, he's a great entertainer. Uh, also, at the end of September, we do have our annual uh, yoga pants party uh, where all of us brewers and bartenders dress up in yoga pants and you can come and uh, enjoy that for yourselves. <laughs> oh, I love it. What are the hours here? When do people, when can people come in and start tasting? Well, uh, starting today at um, noon to 10. Uh, otherwise, most days, uh, Thursdays through Saturday, we are open from noon to midnight. And on Sundays and Mondays, it's um, noon to 10. So uh, we hope to see you guys in here sometime soon. If the doors are locked, come on in. We're taking a quick break from the show. We're going to go find Ashley with Epic Morning in just a bit. But first, a look at that beautiful weather forecast for the day coming up next.